I get asked a lot in my streams, Discord, and on my videos. What lantern is that? What weapons are those? And what clothing set is that? Don't get me wrong, I'm more than happy to answer those questions. However, there is no set of items and clothing that gets as much attention as the Soul Flame set. In today's video, I'm going to show you exactly how you can get it and where you can purchase it. Before we get into the video, only 4.6% of the people watching my content are subscribed. So if you want to help me in reaching my goal of 10,000 subscribers before the end of the year, please make sure to hit that subscribe button. I'm also currently live over on Twitch, so make sure to stop by the stream and say hi. Finally, make sure to join the Mystic Penthouse Discord server to chat with other members of this amazing community, as well as to keep up to date with my current schedules, both on Twitch and YouTube. First things first, there are a couple of prerequisites you need to achieve before you can purchase this set of clothing. These are becoming Pirate Legend, which I have a video on how to do in a very short space of time, link in the description, and a accommodation called Vanquishing the Damned. This commendation is gained by completing the Fort of the Damned 25 times. For those of you who do not know what this is, it's an event which you, the player, can create with all six flames of fate and a ritual skull. The flames are gained by dying in different ways on the Sea of Thieves and the ritual skull can drop in several ways, from ashen chests, skull stashes and world events such as the ashen winds event, skeleton fleets and skull forts. The six flames of fate are gained by dying in the following ways. The green flame is gained from dying to land enemies including skeletons, ocean crawlers and phantoms. The white flame is gained by dying to lightning. The purple flame is gained by dying to venom both from snakes and venom balls. The pink flame is gained by dying to other players. The blue flame is gained by dying to sharks or sirens. And finally the red flame is gained by dying to fire, both fire bombs, volcanoes and the ashen winds boss. Now this may seem a lot, however with the right crew you could work at this over a short period of time and if you are currently a solo player and want to do this with some crew members, I recommend joining my discord as there is always players like yourself looking to get on with other players both experienced and new to the game. Once you've completed the Fort of the Dam 25 times you're going to want to head to the Pirate Legend hideout, here you will need to head to the Athena's Fortune Shop and scroll through the pages until you find the weapons, lantern and outfits. Purchase them with your hard earned gold from the Fort of the Dams and enjoy your cosmetics. If you like this video make sure to subscribe, leave a like, check out the other videos on my channel and I'll see you guys in the next one.